Colonel's offensive line can play well today. To the air for the first time. And a quick catch. KJ Franklin nearly wiggled away. But he went. But unselfish guys as well. That's Tevin Bush in motion. But Scott pulls it back and finds KJ Franklin again. This time up the sideline. Right behind him. And pitch to the outside for Carrington. First down and more. Almost down to the 20 yard line. That's exactly what it is. 22 is the line of scrimmage. Scott goes up top, looking end zone. Touchdown! He got the foot down. Dantes Costly, the burner, puts Nichols up 6 0. You know what? He is an exceptional athlete and he has shown up big this season. Great catch at the back of the end runs and very hard to tackle. We'll check to see on what kind of tackling Nichols is able to do on him today. UIW always going up tempo. Oh, what a throw. Cameron Ward has incredible arm strength. Texas. And a first big carry of the game for Kevin Brown, who's able to surge forward and pick up the first down. Ward pulls it back on the RPO. And on the sideline, Trey Wolf, who had a huge game last week, pulls it in and has the first down. Basketball, fishing at coming out of Kenner. And a quick pass to the inside, Mark Sullivan. First catch of the year. Wow, making moves inside the five yard line. And a flip out in front. Another chance for Sullivan. And he makes the goal line. Touchdown, Mark Sullivan and UIW. Trying to even it up. He can pull that ball down and be dynamic in the run game. Nichols again playing without Julian Gums, their outstanding 2,000 plus yard back for likes his ability. They're down in two. Quick throw out to the tight end, David Mosley, making only his second catch of the season, but a productive one for a first down. To the, their first one took about two minutes, went straight down the field for a touchdown. And right up the sideline, another catch for Dantes Costly, running away for six. Pierre, eight touchdowns, five interceptions. Compare it to this incredible start to his career in this tunnel screen to Robert Farrell. Farrell off and galloping, needs a block. He's down to the 33-yard line. Getting into it in Thibodeau. Some motion instead, a blast by Brown, and he nearly broke away, but it's still a first down. Incredible numbers. First down again. Some late pressure, but Ward still has all day and dumps it over the middle. Church, it's done. Kevin Brown, no doubt. 22 yard score. Been there, and that way you let your linebackers flow and make those tackles off the edge. Straight carry for Scott here, picking his way. First down, Scott can scoot at 5'11", 220 pounds. He doesn't have to do very much more than just orchestrate and deliver that football. Throws it over the middle, and a nice catch by Guggenheim. And although he's sandwiched, including a big hit by the star defensive back, Brandon Richard. Lindsey Scott this season has led his team 50% on third downs this year. Scott, a lot of time, finds that soft middle, K.J. Franklin. The catch and run inside the 25. Scott gives it off to Carrington. A lot of room up the middle. And slides down for a first and goal. Carrington trying to pick his way. Bounces. Lots of space. And the third touchdown in as many drives for the Colonels. It's a 20 to 14 advantage. The extra point makes it 21 to 14. Oh, he missed it off to the left, excuse me. He has two touchdown passes, number 15 and 16 of his freshman season. Slings it side on. Catch made. Chapin trying to break away. Giving some ground and spinning inside the 30-yard line. And Nichols one game behind. Third down and four. And a little catch out in the flat by Robert Farrell. Farrell's able to skitter his way out of bounds. Third down and four. Ward slings it, but it's tipped and incomplete. He is, is almost a stop for the defense. 27-yard kick into the wind and on the way and good. Kind of looks like almost an arena football game here. Which team is going to get the stop on defense? Interesting analogy there, but the field goal is potentially a stop here. Look at these two teams as they want to keep good points on the board. As coming up to grab it is Costly, and Costly finds a lot of room down the sideline. Costly the burner inside the 30, and it's over. Dantes Costly goes the distance. He throws it. 
Quick throw over the middle, and it's complete to Jaden Jones. Jones, the tight end, able to scoot for 14 yards. A shootout. Colonel Faithful getting into it. Cam Ward. What a throw. Right on the money and a sliding grab by Trey Wolf. Field looks to us right there just as the defense is coming in there to get pressure. Second and ten. Ward all day. Surveys and finds his running back. Caleb Ducros. Down by ten. Quick throw to the edge. Ducros has the sideline. Steps inside the ten into that playoff situation. I think you're right. Second down and goal and a quick flip out in front and another touchdown. Robert Farrell. He can't measure him, but he's almost kind of the same way in, in this level as you look at Cameron Ward. K.J. Franklin, another one of these Ferraris. Just opens the holes for him. Scott goes middle, finds his tight end, Lee Negretto, the freshman. With the three-point lead. Backside, Lindsey Scott, oh, jukes a man out of his shoes for a touchdown. And at runners, you may see here in this game, take a look at him, one, two, three, boom. There you go, inside, taking a little, little peek there. This is what they'll have him in the stats in this ball game. Very, very much below average on his day, and there's an interception. Finally, Jordan Jackson able to rein it in. This opportunity for Nichols, Scott. Eludes defenders, off and running, looking for a block. Down the sideline to the 15. Two. On second and nine, Carrington buries the head, blast throughs, touchdown, 14 yards. Carrington second on the ground. Watch 31, he's special. Kind of that slot corner, the rover coming on the blitz right now, and pressuring Cameron Ward, who goes down being punted from their end zone. Kevin Wynn's done a nice job this year as the punter, but only six attempts, and hangs this one into the air and out of bounds. Formation, that's a complete unbalanced formation. Guggenheim takes the toss inside the 25. First down and pushed out from behind. Continually excels or, or one that behind the chains most of the time. Scott has a man wide open into the hands of his receiver. Aldontre Davis for the easy score. This ball down, make a big long throw here. Scott, route is cut off and KJ Frank go to. From midfield, plenty of time. Lindsey Scott, so much space. And goes out of bounds Lindsay after Scott picking up a first. <laughs> Looking for more here at the end of the half. Lindsey Scott's been pretty perfect, and he finds Dejon Dixon for the first time. There goes big play receiver. First down and 10. Scott, right back to the sideline. Franklin's defender falls down, and it's a walk-in. For Carrington, second and two. The motion and handoff. Coming around the outside to pick up the first down. Day. Third and short. Carrington is able to fight his way forward and it should be enough for the first down making the right decisions another look for carrington right up the gut carrington running away fumbles and tries to dive on top of it it is a mad scramble in the end zone he breaks inside the 10 yard line watch carrington he just drops his football one two three he's just pumping away pumping away it comes out of his arm and he slide gets the ball but he slides into the end zone after further review, ruling on the field stand, be first and goal at the two-yard line. Ronnie Jackson getting his first action of the day. Jackson trying to earn the score, and he is in. Five straight points for Nichols. What can UIW to stand up and do something about it? Tolds coming out of his own end zone, but he's blasted, and the ball is free. Nichols recovers at the 15-yard line. Right yeah. there in the midsection, puts his hat right on the football. Yes. Scott, nice pocket, wings it deep and throws it behind a wide open Devontae Jason at the goal line. Saying this would be his career long, his longest is 30 this season. It's two for three. And make it three for four. If you're one-sided, unfortunately, teams can 
oftentimes dial in. Oh, there's a fumble. Ward has it poked out, and it's scooped up by Dore Oob. Oob trying to tiptoe the sideline, and he's knocked out. Over on UIW, take a look. There's the cause fumble there. That's Thurman, I believe, underneath there, and Oob picks that ball up smartly, and then gets knocked out of bounds. Three-yard line for a first down. Scott, nice pocket, zips it middle. And it's caught by Dixon, but well shy of the first down. Lesane able to knock it through. Team, and, and he sees, sees that as a huge takeaway from, from his days with Coach Leach. Big third down for Ward. This one sticks on the hip of Trey Wolf, and it's enough for the first down. Billio with the call, riding the wave, and that should be enough for the first down. A great future ahead of him. At UIW, quick pass to the inside and running away, Hayden Jones. Wow. Jones won't go down. That's a touchdown. And UIW finally back on the board. Jaden Jones with his first career score. Quick throw over the middle, right into the arms of Trey Wolf, and he moves the sticks. Just a little bit of a slot there, but he does it effortlessly. Oh, a nice throw up the sideline. Little double move. Really, he was a basketball star. Their all-time leading uh, basketball player as well. Another dump off to Jaden Jones. Jones with a lot of space. What a talented receiver this kid is. Ward staring left, firing to the end zone. Farrell, what a grab. And a great throw right over his shoulder. Oh, right where he needs to, on the outside, up where his receiver can go up and get it. And and this is not an intentional fake, just a bad hold running out to the side and not able to make it to the end zone. They're always in that two minute mode. Filio, first down. See, stick perfect time for us, at, you know, right in the middle of the season. Cameron Ward on second down, comeback. Catch is made this time by Kalen Nossip, who threw the fourth. UIW trying to make it interesting. Cameron Ward keeps it. Fires at middle. Another catch by Trey Wolf. Cameron Ward has the empty set on second down. Plenty of time. Sees his man in the end zone, and it's Ducros for a touchdown. Quick throw. Only one to make, and it's a connection to Kalen Nossif. Here recently, it looks like UIW is going to try for the onside kick. Carson Moore looking at that wide side of the field and a pretty good opportunity, but it's covered up by Nichols. Kevin Moore, the third, had it. Scott goes to the air and there's Dixon. Dejan Dixon making a catch on the slant. And Z thought was beneath him. He did whatever he was asked to do. He's just a very hardworking and humble kid. So it's really fun seeing him succeed here in Thibodeau now, his final stop of his college career. As, uh, the next big player coming out of Nichols. Quick run and really churning the legs inside the 10 yard line. Half the football. On second down, the throw to the end zone, and it is caught. Touchdown. Dejon Dixon does it. That's the record holder for career touchdown grab.